Hey guys, it's Emily here. So I have a beautiful kit here and I have this outfit that I'm going to unbox. It is Kit's gardening outfit. I actually got this off of eBay because they don't sell it anymore, sadly. But yeah, um, I actually did not have Kit before. A friend got me Kit as a surprise. Um, so yeah, that's how I got her. Um, I haven't did a video about her, but yeah, I got her brand new. She got me her brand new. And, um, yeah, so, um, I couldn't do a video of me unboxing her. I kind of knew I was getting her in some way because she kind of gave me a hint. But, um, yeah, so, but yeah, she's brand new and she's super cute. So, this is Kit. Um, of course, you already know that. <laughs> um, but, anyways, yeah, I kind of wanted her when I was younger. I was, like, really in a big debate on getting her or not. I it was her. I think it, her number is 57. Um, she is like a truly me doll. Um, it was like between them two that I liked it. But my friend got me Kit. So now I have her. But yeah, I kind of wanted her when I was younger. Um, when her movie came out. I remember when her movie came out. And I was like, oh my god, they're going to have Kit's movie. And I was super crazy. But I wasn't really like connected to Ho, um, like Samantha, I like really connected with Ho, Molly I connected with Ho, so I didn't get Ho when I was younger, but now that I'm older, I kind of like really wanted Ho, um, but yes, yeah, so now I have Ho, she's super cute, she has really cute freckles and really cute short hair, you probably can't really see because it is dark outside while I'm filming this, but yeah, she's super cute, but let's move on to the outfit I got Ho. Obviously, this is her meat dress, which is really adorable, but I kind of want to put her something a um, little bit different in her. Because I feel like this outfit isn't really a good reputation of her time, um, if that makes sense. I feel like her old meat dress does. I didn't care for her meat dress that much, um, well, her meat outfit last time before they redid the Be Forever outfit. But I feel like it was really good for her time, though. I just wasn't that crazy about pink and stuff, so that's why. But, yeah, so I really want to get something really cute. And I know this is still a Be Forever outfit, but I do think it's really cute because it has a really cute overalls outfit. So, yeah, they have, like, three overalls outfits for her. But this one was my favorite one, and fall is around the corner. And I know this is kind of, like, most springy, but I think this is a really cute fall outfit. So, yeah. Let's open this up and enough of talking. So I'm going to put Kit in the corner here. So I got off of this off of eBay. Um, I think it might have been used. I'm not really too so. But it's in its original box. So yeah, let's open it. Oh yeah, maybe it is brand new. Look, it still has everything in there. Ooh, this looks super cute. So here's the really cute, oh my god, this is so cute. This is the really cute top. I love this top so much. I love the flowery design on it. It's so cute. Oh, I love this so much. I love that. And then here's like a handband. I think you put over her like that, I think. So here it is. Super cute, matches the top. And then, of course, the overall outfit. Well, this is the overall outfit, but the overall part. Um, I think this is really cute. I really like this. Really cute and has a cute little pocket. I love that so much. Super cute. And then, of course, her boots. I think these are really cute, too. I really like these. Nice boots. And I love the design on the bottom, too. But, yeah, those super cute. But yeah, I think this is brand new because it still has like the packaging peanuts in it. So I got really lucky to find that. I don't know if this is like, this is a Be Forever line. So I don't know how old this is. But yeah, this was my favorite. Like they had like her original one when she was older. And then um, they had um, another one. I don't know what the other one was. But I think that one was like kind of like her farm outfit. That one was like really bright. But this one is just perfect, I think, how I would want to dress Kit. And I'm so excited. So I'm going to undress her in front of you so you can see. But, yeah, so let's do some male can go talking, AG talking. Um, that just sounds so cheesy. But anyways, so I just uploaded three. This is my third video I uploaded today. I did an unboxing of Josefinia. 
I got her brand new. So I did that as unboxing. And then I boxed Mary Ellen's Poodle outfit. She's actually like to the, that side of me right now. But if you want to see her Poodle outfit, you're just going to go have to watch that video though. But um, yeah, so I'm definitely opening a lot of AG stuff today. But it's super fun because I usually don't get to do that. Um, you know, I have got back into American Girl doll this year. So I've been collecting some more stuff. But I've been trying to go too crazy. But I have done custom dolls. And I do actually have them. And I'm so excited to show you guys what they look like. But um, yeah, so here's Kit's meat dress. A little bit up close if you want to look at the design. Just to see if you would want her or not. But yeah, so let's put on her outfit. Super excited. So this actually has wheel buttons. So you actually um, unbutton it, which is I think is so adorable and so fun. Um, it definitely adds it more onto her. So yeah, I, I really wanted to put Kit in a overalls outfit. I just feel like that's so cute for her. And there is another outfit I want for her. It's like a floral dress. I think it's like blue, I think. I forget what other colors in it. Um, I think that dress is um, before they did the before, before You Ever line. But that's another outfit I really want for her. And I actually got lucky and found her scooter at a yard sale. I wanted to show you guys, but I just realized about it that um, I forgot to bring that out. But I found her scooter on... Um, Actually at a yard sale and it was only 10 bucks. So yeah, I got really lucky. I found that and then the bathtub. But of course, I don't really need a bathtub for my dolls. I just don't really have a purpose for that. Um, just because it's from HE doesn't mean I need it. But since I had Kit and it was such a cute scudo, I decided to get it. And of course, you can't get that scudo anymore. So I decided to definitely get it. I did wish they had Grace because that would have like worked out great um, if they had Grace. And if you don't know who Grace is, Grace is um, Kit's um, Basset Hound dog. And I really want to get Grace too because my mom loves Basset Hound. So I think it would be so cute to get it. But anyways, this is Kit's top. This will be cute as just like an like choked with like jeans to be honest if you want to make this as like today because like honestly i feel like someone could wear this outfit as today i see someone but um anyways yeah so i really want to get grace um i know they don't sell who anymore which i really wish they did i think they did for the before every line and now they don't i'm so confused with american girl i don't know why they start selling things like for the um history doll line and then they retire it so quickly because they barely have any outfits and when i grew up they had so much outfits for the history doll line um and it was always so excited to see the outfits in the magazine because it kind of brings them more to life because you know you get to see what they would wear during that time and what they will you know what their style was growing up and it just adds a lot to them. Now, I feel like the only really dolls they have would be kind of like Mary Ellen. Um, I forget what the other doll, Naya, if that's what her name is. They have a lot for her. And then Melanie, I believe. Um, but I feel like everyone else really doesn't have that much clothes or anything. Kaya, they do have a few stuff for Kaya, which is really surprising. Um, but I think everyone really likes her because she's such a unique doll. So I feel like that's why they probably have most stuff for her. Um, I feel like I, I can't tell if I put her overalls buttons on or if I did it wrong. I don't know how it's supposed to go. I don't know if I can tell by the box. But yeah, I think I, yeah, I put it, <laughs> I stopped it in the wrong area. But you have to be really careful with these buttons, by the way. You don't want to tug on them too tightly because they are kind of like so loose um, to the string. So you do want to be careful when you do put this on. Um, if you, you know, if you are younger, I definitely would um, ask your parents 
to help you put this outfit on because you don't want to rip the button. I mean, of course, if you do, I, I'm so someone could probably sew it back on for you. But you definitely want to be careful when you put this outfit on if you're thinking about buying it. But again, I got it, got this outfit off eBay, not from American Go. Um, it used to be on American Go, but of course, it's not anymore, sadly. But um, if you want to get that outfit, I'll definitely check on eBay. So that's what it looks like. Oh my goodness, so cute. I feel like I need to tuck in her shirt a little bit. So that's what it looks like in the front. So cute. So let's put on the boots. I kind of wish they gave you like socks or something. Um, but I guess because you don't really see the socks. So they probably like don't want to like, you know, add more stuff on. I think I was putting the boot on the wrong shoe. Um, but yeah, these shoes are definitely really cute. I think this is a really cute outfit. And again, this is her garden outfit. But I think this looks really cute for fall or even for spring too. Um, I don't know if, you know, you go by the season with the outfits. I'm kind of trying to do that, but it's kind of hard with some dolls. Because, like, of course, Mary Ellen, she's from Florida. So she really doesn't have any winter outfit except for her um, ice skating outfit, I think it's called. I don't even know if they sell that anymore. But I remember seeing it. So that's the only thing they, like have for her so um some of the dolls it's kind of hard to um get an outfit for for the seasons i'm having such big trouble putting this shoe on oh my goodness this is taking so long just because i can't get the shoe on i does anyone else have trouble putting american go doll shoes on or is it just me i don't know but i cannot get her shoe on at all this girlfriend does not want to get her shoes on. The um, the tongue keeps going down on me. Let me try this again. If not, I might give up putting this shoe on and just do it off camera. But I really want to show you guys this whole, whole look, though. Oh, my goodness. But, yeah, putting shoes on the feet is kind of hard to do. I always kind of had trouble doing that when I was younger. It's always really tricky. I kind of wish they had like a zipper going down there. Um, when you get like shoes from other co companies like um, so Sophia, I think it's called. Um, they kind of have shoes that you can kind of zipper, like if it's like a boot or something. Um, instead of like just sliding it on. Because this is not working out. I got the shoe on right. It's just not getting on. I mean, I guess I could untie the shoe, but they look so nice the way they're tied. And the way I tie is definitely not, it's not good. Oh, I think I got it finally. It's like halfway there. Okay. It's like her heel that won't go in. Okay, I finally got it on. I don't know why that took like a long time. But here she is. She looks so cute. Again, I'm using this for a fall look. So, and I know it has flowers, but it would be cute if it had leaves, honestly. That would be so cute. But, um, yeah. So, I'm not too so how this is supposed to go on her. So, I probably will do this wrong. But I'm just going by instinct and thinking this is how you do it. Because she has short hair, so it would have to be a hairband. So, this is what I'm thinking it probably would go. So, as you can see, that's what it looks like. The tag is like sticking out though we don't want the tag sticking out um okay that's a little bit better just gonna have to move it to the front a little bit but yeah that's what she looks like in her garden outfit she looks so cute i love it so much it definitely looks really cute with her hair but yeah so this is what it looks up so close um sorry that you just can't really see well it got dark really really quick um so yeah and i try to turn on as much as light on as possible but yeah, so this is a whole garden outfit. So thank you guys so much for this video, uh, watching these videos. Um, and I hope you guys watch the other videos that I did too. And hopefully this is the last video that you're watching. But if you didn't watch me unbox Mary Ellen's Peter Sko or Josefina, make sure you go check my channel. But yeah, I won't talk any much longer. But yeah, I hope you really love this video and watching me just kit. So yeah, see you next time.